somebody loves you. It's no good unless he loves you. With his crooner voice and rugged good looks, Harry Connick Jr.'s The Whole Package. And ladies, be prepared to swoon again. He's now back with his 25th studio album. Teaming up with legendary producer Clive Davis, the man who discovered Whitney Houston, Your Songs is a collection of covers featuring tracks originally recorded by the likes of Elvis Presley, The Carpenters and even The Beatles. 25th album. I guess when you look at all of them like sort of in a list on paper, it, it, it does look like a lot, you know, but I've been doing it for a really long time and some of the some of the records that I've done really only took a day to record, you know, so, you know, Looking back on them, though, and when you put them all in a group, it is a lot, I guess. Why did you decide to do a cover album? Well, in, the way my recording career has always worked is, you know, if, if it were up to me, I'd go into the studio all the time. I love being in the studio. I love writing music. I love singing covers. I love doing everything, really. Um, but you can't do that because if you know if you keep releasing records and you know it just sort of saturates the market and nobody wants to buy your records anymore that's why you have managers and record labels to sort of help you direct your creative process why do birds suddenly appear the close to you track the carpenters song how did you put your own stamp on that because it's such a familiar song to us i guess what i did was um I really thought about the, the words, which are, are simple, um, and then I thought about the groove of it, you know, like how can I add my little piano thing in there to make it sound like me, and then I, I got my, what really sets it apart is my trumpet player, Leroy Jones, who plays a beautiful solo on it, that really kind of, you know, makes it sound like a little bit funkier, a little bit more New Orleans style. Just like me. But 25 albums, 19 movies and countless TV appearances, what is it for Harry, acting or singing? I think I love what I'm doing when I'm, when I'm doing it, you know. If I had one thing to do, I'd go and play piano the rest of my life. I'll never have to make that decision, hopefully, but, you know, that's really where I started, you know, and then came singing and then came acting and other things. But I, I just like the fact that I've, I've been lucky enough to do all of them. And Your Songs is out now.